What's up squad? My name is ESO and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to be covering a beginner's guide on how to actually start the Dark Brotherhood questline in Skyrim, because it is quite hidden away if you're new to the game. So for those of you that don't know, the Dark Brotherhood are an infamous guild of highly trained assassins. So their questline is pretty awesome if you like killing people and getting rewarded for it. And to start this epic questline, we must first come to Windhelm. And if you've not been before guys, you can just take the carriage outside of Whiterun to this location. It's a very good way to start the quest line from a low level. But Windhelm itself is located just here on the map in the far north reaches of Skyrim. So coming straight here is the fastest way to actually start the quest. And once you do enter the city, you're going to come up through the town just to the right here and then go left through this alleyway. Up ahead you'll see a child talking to a dark elf and we can listen into their conversation. Then it's true, what everyone is saying. That Aventus Aretino is doing the Black Sacrament, trying to summon the Dark Brotherhood? Oh, Grimvar, always with the nonsense. No, no, of course not. Those are just tales. Fine, then I'll invite him out to play. He lives right there. I'm going to knock on his door. No, child, wait! That boy, that house, they are cursed. Ha! <laughs> Then I'm right. I knew it. He's trying to have somebody killed. All right. I won't deny it, child. What you heard is true. But Aventus Aretino walks a dark path. His actions can lead only to ruin. Now, enough. We will speak no more of this. I am the only friend you need. And now we must pick this lock on the door in order to discover what's actually going on inside this house for ourselves. Oh, very tired. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. So, very tired. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized. You've come at last! I knew you would! Are you all right? It worked! I knew you'd come! I just knew it! I did the Black Sacrament over and over with the body and the things, and then you came, an assassin from the Dark Brotherhood. Yes, of course, the Black Sacrament. It took so long, so very long, but now that you're here, you can accept my contract. Contract? My mother, she, she died. I, I'm all alone now. So they sent me to that terrible orphanage in Riften, Honor Hall. The headmistress is an evil, cruel woman. They call her Grella the kind, but she's not kind. She's terrible to all of us. So I ran away and came home and performed the Black Sacrament. Now you're here and you could kill Grella the kind. Please, Ari. To be honest, I'm kind of lonely here. As much as I hated getting sent to Honor Hall, I really miss my friends there. Assassins don't come cheap, boy. I have a family heirloom you can have. It's supposed to be sort of valuable. Uh, I hope that's all right. Please hurry. To be honest, I'm kind of lonely here. As much as I hated getting sent to Honor Hall. And after you're done chatting with the boy, just exit the house. And the next thing we need to do is fast travel to Rifted, because that's where we're going to find our first target. And if you've not yet discovered Riften, guys, you can simply take the carriage from outside the city gate all the way over to Riften. And once you do arrive, guys, we're just going to head straight through the town. And if you haven't already, guys, make sure you check out the description after the video, because I'm going to put some useful guides down there on how to level up your character's archery, one-handed skill, and also your sneak skill very quickly. That will really help you out with this quest line. I've also got some guides on the best weapons you can use for assassins as well, so make sure you check that out too. You're going to find the orphanage though in the corner of the city just over here. Those who shirk their duties will get an extra beating. Do I make myself clear? Yes, yes growler. Yes, growler. And one more thing, I will hear no more talk of adoptions. None of you riffraff is getting adopted, ever. Nobody needs you. Nobody wants you. That, my darling, is why you're here. Why you will always be here. 
until the day you come of age and get thrown into that wide, horrible world. Now, what do you all say? We, we love, love you, Grover. Thank you, thank you for your kindness. For your kindness. That's better. Now scurry off, my little gutter snipes. And we're just going to deliver the swift arrow of death here. And this doesn't count as murder, guys, because nobody's actually seen me kill her. And to be honest, judging by all these children reacting to her death, you're somewhat of a hero now. She's a bit dead! Aventus did it! Ah. <laughs> Hooray! Gorilla the Kind is dead at last! We're saved! And rather interestingly, guys, if you do search her core, you will find the Pig Children book, which is a racist novel about all. So no regrets for killing this racist. And now we just need to exit the orphanage and fast travel back to the boy in Windhelm. And once again, guys, just head on inside this house so we can talk to him. Well, Grohad the Kind, is she, you know? I knew you could do it, I just knew it! I knew the Dark Brotherhood would save me! Here, just like I promised, this should set you a nice price. And thank you. Thank you again. It's a job well done indeed. And he's gonna give us a, a crappy family heirloom worth 100 gold. It's basically just a plate. When I grow up, I'm going to be an assassin. That way I can help lots of children, just like you! And now guys, you're going to want to come outside and fast travel to White Run, just here on the map. And when you reach White Run, you'll see a courier appear in front of you. And this is just a good way to make that happen. But if the courier doesn't appear for you, I suggest that you just wait at the entrance to the city, just where I am now for a few days, and then the courier will eventually show up. But basically guys, we just want to get the mysterious you. letter That's something from I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Yeah, got this note. Don't know. Creepy fella. Black robe. Couldn't see his face. Paid me a pretty sum to get that into your hands, though. Looks like that's it. Got to go. So now, if we take a look at this letter, it's just got a black hand on it. Two words. We know. And now we need to find a place to sleep. So I'm going to go to White Runs Inn and get a bed. And if any of you are familiar with the previous Elder Scrolls games, you'll recognize the significance of the black hand straight away and what it means. It basically represents the hierarchy of the Dark Brotherhood Guild. And definitely look up the lore and background story on that if you are interested. So yeah, we're just going to come in the inn here and pay for our room and go to bed. If it's work you're looking for? Sadie just doesn't know when to quit, does she? So just come over to your bed and go to sleep. And as soon as your head hits that pillow, you'll get a loading screen. You've basically been kidnapped to the middle of nowhere. Sleep well. What? Where am I? Who are you? Does it matter? You're warm, dry, and still very much alive. That's more than can be said for old Grelod, hmm? You know about that? Half of Skyrim knows. Old hag gets butchered in her own orphanage. Things like that tend to get around. Oh, but don't misunderstand. I'm not criticizing. It was a good kill. Old Crone had it coming. And you saved a group of urchins to boot. But there is a slight... Mm, problem. A problem? You see, that little Eratino boy was looking for the Dark Brotherhood. For me, and my associates. Grelod the Kind was, by all rights, a Dark Brotherhood contract. A kill that you stole. A kill you must repay. You want me to murder someone else? Who? Well now, funny you should ask. If you turn around, you'll notice my guests. I've collected them from, well, that's not really important. The here and now, that's what matters. You see, there's a contract out on one of them, and that person can't leave this room alive. But, oh, which one? Go on, see if you can figure it out. Make your choice, make your kill. I just want to observe and admire.
Am I to take your silence as acceptance? Then you know where we stand. Make your kill and we're square. Repayment of your debt is but a discreet knife thrust away. And now you can go and interrogate all these prisoners. If you get all three right, you'll get three speech skill points and also their backstory. So let me just show you how to do that. Whoever this is, clearly we got off on the wrong foot. Ah, uh, but no worries. This is not the first time I have been bagged and dragged. Who are you? Ah, Varsha, at your service. Obtainer of goods, taker of lives, and defiler of daughters. Have you not heard of me? Perhaps I will have my people carve my name in your corpse as a reminder. Would somebody pay to have you killed? Me? <laughs> Are you serious? Answer me, or I'll paint this room with your blood. Fool, don't you get it? I live in the shadow of death every day. A knife in every doorway. A knocked arrow on every rooftop. If one of my enemies would not pay to have me killed, I would take it as a personal insult. Tell you what. You release me, and I promise my associates will not hunt you down like an animal and butcher you in the street. It is a win-win. Get these things off of me! Who are you? None of your damn business who I am. If you're going to kill me, just do it already. Esmara is my witness. If I didn't have this hood on right now, I would spit right in your face. Would someone pay to have you killed? Excuse me? What kind of question is that? It's all right. Just tell me what I need to know. I'm a woman living in Skyrim with six children and no husband. I don't have the time or the patience to be nice. Do some people look down on me? Have I made some enemies? You're damn right. I don't have time for this nonsense. I've got a home to keep and children to feed. Uh, now, I can let hear you talking out, out there. Out of here! Please let me go. I've done nothing to you. Is this about that raid last week? I told Holgrim there was no honor in killing sleeping men, but he wouldn't listen. It wasn't my fault. I swear. Who are you? My name is Fulltime. I'm a soldier. Well, mercenary, really. You know, a, a, a sellsword. I've lived in Skyrim all my life. That's all. I'm a nobody, really. So, can't you just let me go? Was somebody paid to have you killed? What? Oh, God. I don't want to die. Answer me or die. <sighs> Please. I, I don't know. I mean, I'm a soldier. I've killed people when I was ordered to. Maybe there was some times. Sometimes I got carried away but uh, war is war right nobody could blame me for that could they uh, uh, what did i do uh, please whatever it is i'm sorry so those of the sharpest among you may have realized that they all sound pretty guilty they all sound like they've done something wrong so just to be sure let's kill all of them then you can't be wrong. And then we're just going to talk to Astrid once again. Well, well. Aren't we the overachiever? Three possibilities, three victims. Must have been one of them, right? So why take chances? So who was it who actually had the contract? Oh, no, no, no. Don't you understand? Guilt, innocence, right, wrong? Irrelevant. What matters is I ordered you to kill someone, and you obeyed. So I'm free to go? Of course. And you've repaid your debt in full. Here's the key to the shack. But why stop here? I say we take our relationship to the next level. 
I would like to officially extend to you an invitation to join my family, the Dark Brotherhood. In the southwest reaches of Skyrim, in the Pine Forest, you'll find the entrance to our sanctuary. It's just beneath the road, hidden from view. When questioned by the Black Door, answer with the correct passphrase, Silence, my brother. Then you're in, and your new life begins. I'll see you at home. And now, guys, the final part to actually go and join the secret guild itself. We must now fast travel to Falkyrie, which is in the far southwest of Skyrim. And as you can see, the guild is hidden away in the forest here, already marked on your map. So once you arrive from the main entrance to Falkyrie, just head towards the location through the trees here. This is where you'll find the secret entrance to the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. And guys, if you want a full walkthrough on how to get all the unique quest rewards for each contract mission you're going to do, make sure you check out my full walkthrough of the Dark Brotherhood questline. And you can find a link for that down below in the description. But we'll find the door just here. Respond silent, my brother. And this option is only available after somebody gives you password, so you can't just come straight here at the start of a new game, guys. And now let's the adventure begin. Please do like the video if you did find it helpful, guys. And if you haven't already, make sure you smash that subscribe button because I create daily video guides on the ESO channel that you will not want to miss. Have a fantastic day, and I will see you in the next daily guide. Goodbye. Don't forget that you can receive text and or email notifications from my channel every time I release a new video. Underneath the video, just hit subscribe and then hit the bell next to it. You will now get notified as soon as I release a new video. Welcome to the ESO squad, guys.